Esther, my mom, never thought of herself as beautiful. For anyone who knew her, this is a remarkable thing to contemplate. She was exquisitely beautiful and she cared deeply about beauty. People ask me why I'm compelled to paint my mom. Partly, I want to restore her beauty and power from what Alzheimer's stole. She had an immaculate closet with rows of color-coordinated suede pumps, paisley hat boxes with jewel-toned ties piled to the ceiling. It was quietly excruciating to witness it all get dusty and faded, just one example of her incremental vanishing, even as she remained ostensibly here. Edie Thies Morgan, another member of the club with too many of us in it, wrote a recent New York Times article called Losing Your Mom to Alzheimer's Then Finding Her Again. That's what becoming an artist has been for me, pursuing beauty for its own sake and doing so in a way that hopefully touches and connects deeply with others. To quote Edie, I get to miss my mom exactly the way she would want to be missed. This music, taped just months before she died, long after she'd lost all language and the ability to recognize most of us, was our indication that despite everything, some of her remained. Die, die, da 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 da